manual pages, or as they often called, man pages, is a standard source of documentation and reference that comes with every Linux and Unix installation. They are a great source of quality technical information, but unfortunately, they can be difficult to understand for a beginner. Unix Academy's Easy Man Pages take a task of explaining most important functionality of each command and show how to use it. This man page is about command RM. The RM stands for Remove command is used to delete files and directories on Linux and Unix operating systems. The options in the commands format are not mandatory. When used just with the names of one or more files, RM deletes all those files without requiring confirmation by the user. It means that RM command would immediately delete the files. If the files located in the same directory, only file names are required, otherwise you must specify the path to the file's locations. Error messages are returned if a file does not exist or if the user does not have the appropriate permission to delete it. Write protected files prompt the user for a confirmation before removal. Files located in write protected directories can never be removed, even if those files are not write protected. To remove all specified files, forcefully, whether write protected or not, without prompting the user, use F option. It does not display an error message or return error status if a specified file does not exist. However, if an attempt is made to remove files in a write protected directory, this option will not suppress an error message. As a safety measure, RM command does not delete directories by default. In order to delete directories, it is necessary to use the R option. This option recursively removes directories and their contents. It means that the specified directories will first be emptied of any subdirectories and files and then removed. The user is normally prompted for removal of any write protected files in the directories unless the F option is used. Each command features many options and variety of uses. For full information about this command, please see the man page on your system.